When you think about parts made of sheet metal, most people think of HVAC ductwork. But sheet metal is currently being used to make all sorts of parts every day. The entire process starts with programming the customer's idea into a 3D model. Once this model is checked for errors, each part is separated and flattened. Now the process can begin. An entire pallet of sheet metal is loaded onto a steel skid. The machine loads these sheets onto it, so they're ready to be used. Once the program is loaded into the laser, the automation takes over and grabs the sheet needed. Now it's time to laser cut the sheet metal. Once the sheet is loaded onto the laser, the program begins. The laser is capable of cutting up to one inch thick steel and can cut hundreds of inches a minute, yet is still ultra precise, keeping within two thousandths of an inch tolerance. Now that the sheet has been laser cut and unloaded, each piece must be separated before it can move to the next step in the process. One downside to laser cutting is the small but sharp burr can be left on the part. This is easily fixed by running each piece through a large sander. This removes the burr, leaving a smooth finish on the entire part. The next step in the process is bending the metal sheets into shape. The same program that was created for the laser is now used to bend the pieces accurately. Here is a side view of the metal being bent. With 150 tons of pressure, the metal forms quickly and easily. Now on to assembling the part. First, rivets are used to attach each part together. These add strength to the part, as well as lining them up for welding. The part now moves on to welding. Welding not only keeps the part together, it adds strength to the final product. And after grinding, makes the part look seamless. Although multiple process were used to make this single part, each part fits together perfectly in the end. The simple piece of flat sheet metal has now come together to make a sharp looking part.